How's it going everyone? I'm Aaronek and welcome back to Neverending Nightmares. I am going through and doing the other path. So I already finished the game. I got one of the endings. So I'm going to try and get the other endings. I had to look up. I didn't look up anything else uh, about what happens. But I looked up how to access the other endings. So the first one it said that you can access is you can either drop down here at the asylum or you can go back in the door instead of dropping off so this is a different pathway completely now oh now you'll never escape yeah you uh you cut my attendance and huh? what honey go back to sleep uh, uh, why am i in bed with my sister what are you talking about i'm your wife but i you don't even have a sister. I, I... I thought... I'm worried about you. Why don't you get a glass of milk to calm your nerves? Okay. Well, that wasn't how I was expecting this part to start. Alright, um... Alright, well, I'll just, uh... I'll just leave my sister-wife there. I really, I am interested. If it's already that different, how's this gonna, how's it gonna change? What am I gonna encounter now? Because the other version was like, I was encountering like myself. There's nothing in here. And it's always really creepy when you just have the lantern. Or not lantern, but the, the candle. Like that, like I just heard a buzzing sound. Like what was that? Like I didn't know something was about to start chasing me. Alright, well that's that's definitely different. So there were three different overall pathways. Three different sections that it showed that I had not completed. So I'm gonna see how many I can do in this part and I'm thinking perhaps I could just I could do the other two sets in this in this video so we'll see all right it's a different page I believe but it's still not it's still in scripture so I can't read it I'm really wondering, like, what's gonna happen? I just hear this, like, creeping sound like there's somebody behind me. Okay, well, I am definitely not going to the kitchen for milk, but... Going into the basement. Not the basement, but clock. That's a pair of feet. They're about to hang themselves. Hello, clock. Do you have anything creepy up there too? Like the one that just chopped the head off of the person? It'd be interesting if like I went and got the glass of milk and like everything seemed like for the most part normal but then like the return trip was all messed up just grog 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 all right I'm all done yeah it appears that's what it's gonna be like so now everything's gonna be all like messed up for the walk back Hello. Sorry, I'll I'll just get the glass in the morning. I was really expecting something with like, oh, the painting changed. They're hanging now. I I I like that detail. 
Oh, I should have been looking at more paintings. I don't know if any more of them really changed. Yeah, that was a weird interaction. I just... That doll's there now. That doll wasn't there before. I'm expecting some scary shit to start going down now. They had the build up going right now. Pretty damn good. I'm ready to be spooked. Wait. What? Isn't this the same exact room I was just in? Alright, one more and then I'll turn around. Anything in the bed? Nope. Okay, I'll just turn. Back out this way then. Okay. Wow, that was cool. That was cool and creepy at the same time. So I don't know what rooms I'm gonna end up in now. Thank you, Colonel Standing. Ah, oh, God. Thomas. Just keep ending up in the bathroom. All right. Let's uh gonna happen now one thing I'm wondering too is which one is tr like the true ending of the game gonna be because there's three different endings and I'm taking the ending I got as the one I got I mean I can't when I was at the insane asylum oh that's just a bear <laughs> that's just a bear <laughs> All right, I was taking the ending, like I was um, I'm taking the ending I got as the, like my true ending for right now. But uh, when I was at the insane asylum, I was thinking that uh, I could have just gone back inside. So I mean, I was kind of fifty-fifty on that option. What the hell? I think that was like my sister or the wife or whatever and she was holding an axe. She was laughing because it was funny. Okay. That seems like the way I'm supposed to go though. I think she's gone now. Yeah, she's gone now. Damn. Damn, this is... Ah. Oh. This is really, really getting... Getting me, like, focused and startled. What's going on? Alright. Um. Okay, what? Yeah, it's her. I just don't know what I'm supposed to do. She moves slow. So can I just... Oh! What? 
can it actually get me or is it just like there to like startle me so I see it in the dark and then I just get startled okay well I'm going farther back downstairs hope I didn't go oh this this part's also really good I really like the last part of the last section and I really like this one too they they did an amazing job on these last two levels it, it's funny because they don't even they don't even have to overlap you could play the game all the way through and still never experience like you could just not experience this in a playthrough Alright, well, this does look like the room. Hmm. So I'm not sure if I've encountered anything deadly yet, though. Hello. That looks pretty hella deadly, though. Unless you're just supposed to avoid it for, like, a minute. Like, you're just supposed to back up from it and not let it touch you. I'm so incredibly focused right now. Alright, I gotta... I have to just sit back and relax. So, it's a relaxing experience. You just, you just calmly have to walk through the dark and engage in all the scary-ass things. way I really don't know which way I'm supposed to go this is just just been leading me on and on yep there you are hello I'm assuming like all the other sections when I see that look at that face that is a pretty face Very lovely. Oh! She appeared behind me. Maybe she just like teleports or something. I have no clue. I'm not 100% on the mechanics. Okay, I probably just have to continue going down like all the other sections. Just continue towards the common goal. This area being the stairs. Oh, this is different. I'm just walking through the dark. I probably have to listen for sparks. You got me. Holy shit. Don't do it again though. Yep, there's the sparks. I can still kind of see the outline of like my character and that. But... I just gotta wait for it to disappear. She disappeared now. <sighs> Jesus. This is really inventive that they did this. 
They really innovated for this portion. That was odd. It was like getting to the end of the section and then it changed. I like this. At the same time I don't, because I don't know what they're going to show me. Hello. Oh, jeez. These images are like, incredibly, incredibly creepy. Oh, I have nowhere to go. <laughs> okay, so that explains the whole meat grinder thing. All right, now, um, I'm looking at my time. This might be a little bit longer of a part because I wanted to, I wanted to get at least one ending done in this. Jesus, that meat grinder though. Just... They did a great job on this section. Oh no, I'm like back to where I was. Hello. Uh, why does that have to bling? It seems it really, really simple to like the beginning of the game though. Simple like the beginning of the game, I mean. Yeah, here's the cupboard, so I might have to avoid the babies again. Alright, I, I, I'm thinking about it. I think what I should do is I should just cut it here. And then, um, try and... I think I'm for sure going to finish up everything every last part of the game in the next part i think that's what my plan is right now it it, it would seem the smartest just to, um have like one short one and then even if the next one's like a half hour long so be it i'll just i'll just play through the rest of the game like right like right after this and just do one solid video and then i'll have six parts on this game and that'll be good so for now thank you so much for watching if you like the video please go down below and let me know like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.